It is such an honor and so humbling to receive this award, particularly because of the way it recognizes the link between what we do in the classroom and what we do as artists and scholars. Everything that I do, I feel, is rooted in Jesuit values of caring for others, of seeing the whole person, getting students to really set the world on fire in order to bring about justice. I find at Georgetown there's a real culture of curiosity. Students who come here, who take my classes, they're very eager to learn about all sorts of things. And I'm proud to be a part of that. So I've been teaching in prisons now for almost a decade and I've discovered some extraordinary students and people and what I decided to do in my Georgetown teaching is to try to bring those two worlds together. Everything that I do is to try to correct injustice, to try to help make our world a better place and to bring Georgetown into a leading role in producing this change through our students, through our research, through our programs. Launching the MA-PhD Certificate in Disability Studies is one of the high points of my career at Georgetown because it's enabled us together to forge a real intellectual community for our graduate students who are the future of scholarship and art making in disability studies. In my acknowledgments, it's often my undergraduate students I'm thanking. They help me so much and the sorts of topics that I explore. We're teaching future leaders. And one of the questions we talk a lot about in my classes is leadership and what sorts of qualities make for a leader, what qualities make for a good leader, what qualities are needed. I believe in meeting students where they are and honoring where they are. If a student feels safe and feels recognized and appreciated for where they are, then they'll be willing to extend themselves to go somewhere that might be a little scary and new. From the moment I set foot on the Georgetown campus as a job candidate, there was just such a cheerfulness as I was walking around. Students seemed happy. There was so much engagement. And I've always felt that about Georgetown ever since. I just feel good every single day knowing the number of students that I've been able to interact with and know their values, their beliefs, but also their actions, that they are making the world a better place through the shared experience that we've had in my classroom. Georgetown has always had my back, and it's been really a, a joy and an honor and a privilege to represent Georgetown in this area. I hope my students feel like they can change anything they see, that through art, critical thinking, and their own imaginations, they can transform the culture. History is always a conversation between the present and the past, and we can look at the historical record to try to answer questions about where we are and where we might be going. <laughs>